what's up? It's your boy Carcino here. And like I always tell you guys, you want to support the page, uh, click the link in the description box and do so. We appreciate all the love and the support. Uh, what more is there to say, actually, in actuality? As we take everything up a notch. John Wall has finally hit the wall. In fear that he might be traded, opted to have surgery on his heel so that he stays in Washington. They cannot trade him. Very smart and wise move by John Wall. So now it's like, okay, we can't blame John Wall anymore. He gets to sit out sit down, and now they're out of their misery. Well, look, the situation is this. This is uh, another situation where, how can I put this? You walk in the locker room and the same players who minutes ago was like, all right, here we go. And next thing you know, you look around, John Wall is out of the picture. Claimed he's been an ailment for a long time. He hasn't been 100%. And it was about pain management. He's been playing hurt for a long time. He had a couple of DMPs. Um... And the Wizards just gone ahead and announced that Wall's going to have season injured surgery to remove the damaged tissue around his left heel and Achilles tendon. You know, bone spurs, you know, lodged in his Achilles, and that is pretty painful. As I've been told, that is very painful. And he's been dealing with it for a long time. It's not his fault. That is a very painful and aggravating thing, and it's cutting into the tendon itself to have those bone spurs working its way up there, and you don't want it to cut into the tendon anymore. So he's going to be out six to eight months, almost a year. So this will go all the way into next season, you know, to have this surgery. So to shut it down now, you're not making the playoffs. Everybody know that. So why even continue it? Shut it down now so you could be ready for next season. And let's talk about Trevor Reza. Trevor Reza has been there and changed absolutely nothing for the team. <laughs> They're two and five since Trevor Reza has been there. And of course, Trevor Reza is eligible now to be traded again. And <laughs> he might end up somewhere else. I am kid you not. This is the direction the team is looking at right now. You know, and he's more valuable to a team that's contending. So picking up right now any assets they can for a guy who's like about to be 34 and a wingman makes more sense for them. You know? That's what I'm looking at. A lot of people want Bradley Bill. They think they should try you Bradley Bill. But then if you do that, you're going into what do we call a full rebuild, and that's that. Well, you got a free agency that contends with Kevin Durant.
And with Kevin Durant, you're looking at a situation where they want him to come back to his hometown and they want to roll out the carpet, but I don't think he's doing that. That's not, he might go to the Knicks before he comes to the Washington Wizards. Uh, Kawhi Leonard's on the table. He's not coming there. Anthony Davis is on the horizon. And those are the three biggest names in next year's draft. So you're looking at Bradley Beal being flown into the summer, and he's going to be in the NBA landscape to probably move. Now, they beat the Hornets, and everybody's got their head down about the future of the Washington <laughs> Wizards and where it's going to go. But see, the thing is they possess some players that could go to other teams that could turn a team around. You know, Ariza could go to a certain team and turn the narrative around. And I think they will trade him again. That's just how crazy the league is right now. They could turn around, turn around, and trade him again. So, now that John Wall's uh, injury has been assessed, and a lot of people say it's, you know, to keep him from being traded, that's true, because had they tried to trade him, his injury, he wouldn't have probably, probably passed the physical. And they wouldn't have been able to do this anyway. So, the surgery was the best thing they could do with John Wall. So, I don't know. I mean, if you're the Washington Wizards, right now they got a 9% chance of getting Zion. <laughs> and a 2019 NBA draft, but they're only, what, two games ahead of the fifth worst team, the Atlanta Hawks? So, I don't know. We'll see what happens. Touchdown, Chicago Bears. I'm out.